Okay, so we left off me showing you this, but your big push, your your your, you seem excited to get started on the roasting. Yes. So you're actually going to be getting green beans in this space, and you are going to do the roasting. You got it. And the grinding. You got it. So you'll be selling more than just cups of coffee. Someone could come in and possibly buy buy it by the pound. Or? Buy it by the pound. Buy it. We can grind it for you. You can take it home already. Just you know, just lean as well. And, um, and we want to be able to service some local restaurants as well. Oh, that's a so, good idea. Yeah. So are you going to... We want our coffee everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> now you have, uh, you again, you've been open two weeks. Are you seeing much uh, traffic, which I would assume you would, being you know around two hotels, being within a building? Are you seeing a lot of bodies? We do. We see a lot of traffic through both the restaurants and St. Clair Colleges in here. Our, our students are loving that they have some place quick and easy to run to. And this is like the summer so the, you're yeah. not even seeing no, the full like the, yeah. the brunt of the student body right and there's been quite a few conventions and stuff that happened at the uh, Cleary as well so there's a lot of action do you do that. you have a heads up on this stuff like do you know when these groups are coming through somehow or you just kind of find out when they walk in and tell you they're um, in town a little bit of both see today we had someone come in that said there was going to be a kids chess tournament in the first week of July so that one I was aware of but when uh, QP came no we weren't aware <laughs> of it so we had you know a lot of traffic that way and we weren't but it's and, nice to know and it is nice to know especially because you're in a high traffic area how to prepare yeah. and and that said you have done this for two weeks you're going to have uh your hours likely changing here and there so people will eventually be able to find out when you get into a groove and you have them posted on your your front door yes. likely Correct. but you're going to be open quite a bit right now and uh, well, I, I just appreciate you taking the time. So if anyone comes in, they're most likely to, to find you I will be preparing here. food yeah, for them. Every, every day, um, Tuesday through Friday, and then Saturdays and Sundays is hit and miss. Heather, yeah, there will be somebody. Thank you very much for taking time out. Uh, again, take it from me. I, I, I'm coming into a space, somebody who's brand new doing uh, something in the downtown, and you have them already trying to sell local art for artists and there are price tags on this work if you come in and you have something to eat and you see something you like that always wins me over heather so we, we, what, what's the address here i see 101 here that's our unit number it's 333 riverside drive west 333 riverside drive west you must know where this is again unit 101 you cannot miss it come and give this uh, give this place a try